This week, my friend Mihir and I are setting sail with Sail Croatia around the beautiful Adriatic Sea. We're visiting islands all around Croatia's Dalmatian coast, and we're in for an adventure that neither of us anticipated. Oh my god. <laughs> I was taking video, my back was rolling away. Hey, hello everybody. Welcome back to the vlog. Today we are in Split Croatia. Mahir and I are here and we're about to start our week-long adventure with Sail Croatia, exploring the Adriatic Sea. I am so excited. One of my dreams this summer was to go on a sailboat and explore Croatia. And we were planning a trip to Croatia, but, but, then I got in contact with Sail Croatia and they invited me and Mahir to come along and experience their whole tour, the Under 35's tour. And so this is gonna be a whirlwind adventure this week. I really have no idea what's in store. It's gonna be a wild ride. I'm so ready though. Seriously, just got to the marina in Split. We're about to go hop on the boat, meet the people, see what's going on, and then literally let the adventure take us away but the thing to know first of all is that it's incredibly beautiful here it's also spicy and warm it is hot it is <laughs> really, really really warm real we spent the morning <laughs> walking around trying to find all of our provisions we had to find some bottled water and we had to buy beach towels which was a bit of a struggle if you saw the last vlog but we got it we're all good and now we're gonna head and find our boat and see what our living situation is gonna be like the next week so i'm super excited and let's get this week started amen Honestly, like, I'm so excited, like, living on this boat is about to be iconic, like, the ports we're going to, and, like, it just seems, like, very, like, it's, like, very intimate, and we'll be able to, like, jump off, explore, have, like, the best time, so I cannot wait. I'm gonna put the camera over here, and you can see kind of what our berth looks like here. Exactly. I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna Uh, yeah, it's Right now we are in Split, in the ASM Marina. And from here, after everybody gets situated and everything, we're gonna go to Bobovišća, which is the closest place. And it's really nice, it's a small Dalmatian yeah. city. Is she at least kind of cold? Yeah, she's like reasonably cold. Okay, she'll do it for us. So we just got underway for our Sail Croatia adventure. We just hit the open seas and we've met everyone on the boat. There's eight of us here and one skipper and he's gonna take us around for the whole week. Do you wanna introduce yourself to the vlog? G'day, I won't be overly Australian for this vlog. I mean, you can... My name is Mark, um, I am from Australia. Um, this young man is, you've got his name. Mahir. Mahir. Mahir, no, Mahir. no, I remembered that. Mahir. Yeah. You, you, you heard <laughs> you okay, so here's the thing. Literally, I'm the only person who has no connection to Australia here because even though Mahir and I are the only two Americans out of the eight people on board, he has been living in Australia. So he's like quasi connected to it, right? So I'm literally the only American, but I'm telling people like Canadian, which I am. So. Anyways, we're cracking open the rosé. The whole thing about this sail operation thing is that it's kind of like a party at sea. We're traveling with two other sailing yachts. We're gonna meet up with them in the bays at night and kind of have a collective experience together. So that being said, let's pop this rosé and head to the deck. <laughs> Screw you, my friend, know how to vlog. Oh my god. <laughs> Alicia, you're already in the water? Are you guys gonna jump? Wait, I wanna film in slow motion. First sail, we made it to our first dock of the night, and we are in this beautiful bay. It is so spectacular here. We're about to go for a little swim. Huh? Sam's got the drink in the water. I know they literally jumped in the water with beer in their hand. Can I say iconic? Where they jump from? 
Everyone's been jumping from right there. Okay, this is happening. Okay, go for it. Okay, come on, boys. Cheers. Hold on. I need to get on to what you're Croatia. I, uh, hold on. It's Miss Prosecco. You've never had oh, Miss there's, Prosecco? There's a bunch oh, Jesus Christ. Fuck. Cheers, honey. Cheers, legends. Cheers. Yeah, the boys. We are on our way to dinner on this dinghy. Everyone say hi. Hi. Gracias. Gracias. Okay, so once again, I'm the get only the American Thank person you? here at a bunch of Australians. But I mean, when I say we're taking it, I do love it in a little bit. I really do love it. And when I say dinghy ride, I mean literally like 15 feet between our boat. Fuck. And the shore. Like, it really wasn't much of a ride, guys. Oh, God. It was a long ride. We're on our way to dinner now oh, at this place we already made reservations. We already made, like, picked our dishes. Yeah, I, we're, we're I mean, we're, we're all. Everybody got the cod. We're all getting the cod. Every single one. The sea bass. The sea bass. Just no Thank you. Vlogging, my friend. Mate. Hey. But I'm from Johannesburg. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, God. This is Croatia. This guy accent. This is what happens when a whole bunch of Australians drink all afternoon. All right, all right, all right, all right. My name is Boris. I'm from a Australia. Okay, 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 bye. <laughs> Give me here, tell them what's just happened. Okay, so like the fish that they've given us, it's like the full body. And like, I don't want to cut off the head. And like, oh, I don't want to debone it. Like, I literally don't want to deal with it. We're trying to vlog, but we can't vlog because. If you kiss it, it's no, forgiven. Tongue or no tongue? tongue Pick up no the fish and kiss it. Oh, but it's your food. No, you yeah. Oh god. Australian's gone wild on top. Yeah, that's what I meant. Yeah. 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 Oh god, he's oh, holy. Oh, he just kissed the fish. Oh my god. Oh. I came to Europe to experiment, but this was too far. So good morning everybody, it's day two of our adventure with South Croatia and we are leaving the first harbor right now. Today we're on the way to Makarska though, which is back on the mainland and it's about 8 in the morning, an early departure, I'm the only one up right now besides the captain in the boat. You can hear my voice, still sounds a little bit raspy, I literally just woke up and have not had coffee or anything, but look at how amazing this day is going to be you guys. So on our journey to Makarska, we've stopped at a swim spot, and this is such an amazing little bay. We're gonna get the drone up here because apparently the water looks like tattoos underneath because there's so much coral and seaweed. The sun's just come out, and everyone's just kind of woken up on our first like full morning on the adventure, and it's such a beautiful day. So we're a few minutes away from pulling into our port for tonight, which is called Makarska. It's at the base of these beautiful mountains, which are honestly exceptionally tall. Who would have thought there'd be such tall mountains right next to the sea in Croatia? I personally did not. We ended up not sailing today, but we've been on the water for about six or seven hours. It's been quite a long day, but um, this is apparently going to be a pretty fun place with lots of bars and restaurants. So fun fact, there's a cave on the beach over here, which is actually where we're having a party tonight. Apparently there's a club inside this cave. We're just pulling in right now to Makarska, and it looks so beautiful. Again, this mountain is just so unbelievably huge right above the city. We 
the club is over there. It's called Deep, you see where it says it. Uh, I would recommend around 10 30, 11, 11 30, something like that. By that time, you can drink either on the boat or there is a glacier bars that you can go to. Okay, there's the most phenomenal sunset happening right now in Makarsko. We've spent the past couple hours here. We had an amazing lunch in Warnock, the city. This place is so cute and I love seeing these different cities. This feels totally different than Split and obviously there's a huge culture around this whole marina and ship traffic coming in, tourism. We just walked around for an hour trying to find a bag of ice for our drinks tonight, but we had a little bit of struggle finding that. But with that being said, we like walked all up the hill and saw different parts of the city, which is always such a good experience. Anyways. It's drone time because this is just such an amazing sunset right now and the light is just so beautiful and like cascading across the mountains. Again, super, super happy to be here in Croatia. And tonight we're actually going partying in this cave. There's a club in a cave and we're gonna go apparently party and see what happens there. It's fun because there's actually three boats traveling in our flotilla. We have Go With The Flow next door, Doobie over there. We are on Jubilo, sailing yacht Jubilo. And it's been a good time. Everyone has been super, super, super chill so far. Like I said, there's eight people on our boat, and then there's six and five on the other boat. So in total, we're a group of about, what is that, like just under 20 people? About 20 people? It's the end of day two, and I'm really feeling like I'm living large here in Croatia. This is such an amazing opportunity to experience, and I'm so happy that I was able to come and do this. We have so many more days. I can't wait to show you guys what's going to happen next, because I honestly, I have no idea. So that's the beauty of it. Look at you, sir. Mr. Fuji Film, taking in the sunset. Amen. our first two days on board sailing yacht Jubilo. However, what happened next, we were not ready for. I want to keep it really like real with them, you know, like we missed the taxi we wanted to take. Can you not get that camera that close to my face? Really, really big waves. Apparently not going to be safe for us to sit on the bow. 